6 Financial Tips for Young Adults There are still knowledge gaps for young adults to learn how to manage money, apply for credit, and stay out of debt. 1. Pay with cash, not credit. Exercise patience and self-control with your finances. If you wait and save money for what you need, you will pay with cash or a debit card to deduct money directly from your checking account and avoid using a credit card. A credit card is a loan that accumulates interest unless you can afford to pay off the balance in full every month. Credit cards can help you build a good credit score but use them for emergencies only. 2. Educate yourself. Take charge of your financial future and read a few basic books on personal finance. Once armed with knowledge, don't let anyone take you off track, whether a significant other who encourages you to waste money or friends who plan expensive trips and events you can't afford. Research professionals like financial planners, mortgage lenders, or accountants before utilizing their services. 3. Learn to budget. Once you've read a few personal finance books, you will understand two rules. Never let your expenses exceed your income, and watch where your money goes. The best way to do this is by budgeting and creating a personal spending plan to track the money coming in and going out. Tracking expenses, like your expensive morning coffee, can provide a valuable wake-up call. Small changes in your everyday expenses are under your control and can impact your financial situation. Keeping monthly expenses, like rent, as low as possible can save you money over time and put you in a position to invest in your own home sooner than later. 4. Start an emergency fund. A mantra in personal finance is, pay yourself first, which means saving money for emergencies and your future. This simple practice keeps you out of trouble financially and helps you sleep better at night. The tightest budget should put some money into an emergency fund every month. Once you get into the habit of saving money, you will stop treating savings as optional and start treating it as a required monthly expense. Many accounts offer the power of compound interest, such as a high-yield savings account, short-term certificate of deposit, CD, or money market account. 5. Save for retirement now. No matter how young you are, plan for your retirement now. With the power of compound interest, when you start saving in your 20s, you will earn interest not only on the principal you deposit but also on the interest you earn over time, and you will have what you need to retire someday. 6. Protect your wealth. If you rent, get renter's insurance to protect the contents of your home from loss due to burglary or fire. Read the policy carefully to see what's covered and what isn't. Disability insurance protects your ability to earn an income by providing you with a steady income if you are unable to work for an extended period due to illness or injury. If you want help managing your money, find a fee-only financial planner to provide unbiased advice. Unlike a commission-based financial advisor, who earns money when you sign up with the investments their company markets, a fee-only planner can provide advice in your best interest. How do I choose a financial advisor? An excellent choice for a young adult is a fee-only financial planner. Unlike a commission-based advisor, who earns a commission if they sign you up with their company's investment plans, a fee-only planner has no personal incentive beyond your best interest, so they have no reason not to give you unbiased advice. Why is compound interest so powerful? Compound interest is one of the most powerful forces in finance because it grows your money exponentially which means it can supercharge your savings over time. You earn interest on your principal and on the interest you earn. The bottom line. You don't need an MBA in finance or specialized training to become an expert at managing your finances. By following these six tips, you will be on the path to financial security.